Chapter 905 Trump's eyes widened in shock when he read Drew's message. Drew was right. Trump was indeed afraid that Drew would become his rival in love, but of course, he couldn't say such things in public. He was still a married man, after all. Hence, he said against his real intention, No, I'm just worried that you find it hard to blend in here after spending years in Korea. We aren't getting any younger and our bodies are aging too, it will take a toll on your health if we rashly shift to an unfamiliar place that your body hasn't gotten used to. Drew giggled in amusement and said, Oh, I'm perfectly healthy, don't you worry about me. Trump couldn't be bothered with the teasing anymore. He put his phone in his pocket and said, Nataria, let's go inside and take a walk around. Nataria nodded and strolled around the campus with him. At 10 a.m., Nataria checked her watch and said, Hey, the reunion is at 11, I think we'd better get going now. Trump nodded and smiled. All right, let's go. Then, they went to his BMW and drove to Cubana. This time, Viley had reserved a suite on the 14th floor of the club for Nataria's gathering, which was held at the top level where normal members could not reach. Trump couldn't help being a little befuddled and surprised. The last time he was here, he had gone to the 10th floor because of Alex's friendship with Don Stephen, but he didn't expect Viley to be able to reserve a suite on the 14th floor. It was said that the 6th floor was not open to the public and was reserved only for the Adair family, which meant that Viley must be a member of the highest tier. Besides, if the 10th floor was already extremely luxurious, he wondered how magnificent the 14th floor would be. As the elevator went all the way up, Trump asked curiously, Nat Arya, is Viley close to the Adair family? She nodded. They have been one of our clients for many years. We have helped them deal with a lot of legal problems and issues over the years, so they are quite kind and generous to us. Trump was impressed and amazed. Viley was such a young man with fine quality and a promising future. They arrived at the huge luxury suite on the 14th floor, where many of their college mates were waiting in the suite. There was a grand and majestic table in the middle of the suite that could accommodate 50 people at a time. It was an electric table that would rotate the dishes in front of you at a constant speed so that everyone could taste every dish without standing or moving around. In fact, the table was so large that it could accommodate a hundred dishes on it at the same time. It was estimated that the meal today cost $20,000 per person on average. There were more than 40 people who attended the reunion today, which was much more than their previous gathering. At the end of the day, Viley would likely have to spend at least $1 million for today's reunion. Everyone was dumbfounded when they saw Nat Arya and Trump coming together. A nosy voice resonated, Hey, Nat Arya, why are you here with Trump? Yeah. Did you bump into each other downstairs? Or did you guys come together? Among the crowd, a very stylish middle-aged man in a bespoke suit and slick hairdo was glaring at Nat Arya like a hawk watching its prey. The man was Drew.